Showtime, baby. One more toy for the toy box. Of course, I'm talking about grippers, right? So, because I'm a big proponent of those, I ordered this, Amazon. I don't know how the hell you pronounce this. S-A-V-L-D-O. I don't, it's not Sal, Sabal, Sabal, that, right? But it's adjustable. Let me see what they got here. Anybody knows I'm a sucker for a hand gripper, you know? Ooh, come, came in a bag. Okay. All right. Gripper review. Comes in this cool bag, all right? And, oh, okay. Comes with uh, different kind of handles here. Like stuff you put on. So, they come with this. I guess you could put it on a handle or the custom made, you know, you can put that on the handle. But, they look kind of weird, right? So here's what these look like. Now, before we get into all this, um, I'm a sucker, I got all kind of grippers. I got Captain's of Crush, Warren Tennings, Zenith grippers, um, Heavy Duty grippers, uh, the Ivanko gripper, all, all kind of stuff you can think of, right? Um, some grippers from uh, Silvis, you know? This, as you can see, the shape is just real weird, right? You would think as wide as it is, but these are adjustable and this is how they adjustable they are. See this gap right here? What you can do is, if I'm doing this right, Ah, you can pull it down. See that? You can make it. And if you, I don't know if you can see this, but here you can see the different, I'll do it this way so you can see. See how that, it tells you right there where all those are. So you got, you know, 50, no, 50, 75, 100, 125, 150. So at the highest point, it's at 150 pounds of uh, pressure to squeeze it. So in other, in other words, the further you are, the easiest to squeeze, but the further the handles go up, the harder it is to squeeze. Right? I like that. It's pretty unique. Not every not every gripper offers that kind of stuff, you know. So that's pretty cool. So I think I'm gonna have to play with this for a while. But I do like the fact that you can slide these bad boys out like that. That's pretty cool because then. If you wanna know how strong you are, you can gauge it by that, right? You can gauge this by, oh, I'm gonna hit 25, cool. Once you start cranking out a bunch of reps, you go up to the next one, which is 50. You do that, 75, and so on, so you get to 150, which is the very top over here. So that's pretty cool, because not all grippers you know, offer that kind of thing. That's pretty unique. So I got this from Amazon, again, comes in this cool bag, right? That's the actual gripper name, you know, brand name. Then it comes with these kind of handles, comes with the actual handles here. You know, that's pretty cool. Pretty unique. I probably won't use these because I don't need all these other foam handles. I really don't need that stuff. I like to feel the knurling, honestly, myself. So I'm about to give these a try. But um, if I were to do a review on these, pretty unique, pretty weird and bold. I can still squeeze that. The only problem I got is when I happen to squeeze it, it tends to want to slide, so I got to figure out, is there a way you can lock this in? Oh, I guess you can. Oh, okay, cool. So basically what you can do is, once you get to your certain level, you can spin these top ones and they tighten, so that way it's a... Uh... Oh yeah, I'm liking that. I think I might have to use these at work tonight when I hit the graveyard shift. Oh yeah, I'm liking that. So it's pretty cool. And, as a gripper, I go with to slide these bad boys down because what you can do, and this is where everybody kind of goes, grippers are counterproductive for arm wrestling. It's not that hard, because when I grip these down and tighten this stuff, you know, let's just say I'm at 125 right now, right? What I can do, once I screw this down tight, is that I can use this upside down, because now I can take these and work the fingers, right? Exactly, right? I can still keep my wrist just like that, people. Not like this, I can keep it just like that, and still squeeze that because I don't have the fucking gripper like this, right? And it's like, oh, I can't do that. You know, you flip it upside down, you do it from that point, boom. Just like that, see my wrist is not backwards, it's just like that, and I can still get a good workout. There you go, for all you non-gripper -gri believers out there. So anyway, 
Check it out, Amazon. Boom, there you go. This is the box that comes in, comes in a cool pouch. I like it. Of course I do. I'm a gripper lover. Ha! Y'all have a good one.